guys, so today I'm going to the city of Chicago for a little day trip. I have five beautiful bags here to choose from. So I think I'm gonna go with this one because it's gonna match my outfit the best. And it has the cute little lettering on the strap. So let's try my outfit and see. Okay, so here's the full look. I think it's so cute and I think the bag matches perfectly. And now I'm all ready to go, so I'll see you guys in the city. Before entering the heart of the Windy City, a nice place to come take pictures is by the Skyline Wall. Popular with photographers, this lookout offers an unobstructed view of the Chicago city skyline. We are now driving on Michigan Ave on our way to Millennium Park to see one of Chicago's most famous attractions. Go. Welcome to Millennium Park, the home of a very famous attraction, the Bee. <laughs> its mirror-like surface reflects images of the lights around the park and surrounding skyline, making it especially pretty to come see at night. On our way over to Maggie Daly Park, we pass right by the gorgeous J. Pritzker Pavilion, where they host various musical events. And I just had to make a quick stop on the bridge to take a picture of the beautiful city. During the holiday season, one of my favorite places to come visit is the skating rink here in Maggie Daly Park. So come skating with us. Rent or bring your own skates, this rink has everything you could need. It was the most perfect day to hit the ice in the city as the sun was out and bright and there are not too many people skating. Here I am ordering a hot chocolate from the Ring Cafe, a cute place to order drinks and food located right off the ice. Walking through the bustling city, it's important to stop and take a look at the beautiful holiday decorations that they have up. As you walk into the Chris Kringle Market, you are greeted with the smell of roasted nuts, fresh pretzels, bratwurst, and hot spiced wine, the sound of festive music, and the glimmering of sparkling Christmas ornaments, all in a cozy atmosphere. There are so many shops, it was hard for me to decide where to even begin. They had custom ornaments, vintage clocks, and lots of many handmade pieces. The market in Chicago is the most authentic traditional holiday market of its kind outside of Europe, offering a unique shopping experience. Ooh. 
Cool. Thank you. We made our way to the other market inside to take a quick break from the cold. Here I found a few cute pieces that I wanted to get my mom for Christmas. Michigan Ave has plenty of shops, lots of little vendors all over the place. It's just a good place to come and walk. Here we are entering a new spot called Urban Space that has a wide variety of food markets ranging from donuts to sushi. Michigan Ave has just about any store you can think of. We headed to Nordstrom Rack to do some holiday gift shopping. As Chicago is preparing to hit peak winter weather, you can see stores preparing with lots of heavy coats, gloves, and hats. They don't call it the Windy City for nothing. As the day comes to an end, I spend my last moments walking and enjoying the city lights and pretty views. Thank you Chicago for an amazing day in the city. Until next time.